Oke, okay, halo semuanya. Jumpa lagi dengan saya dan Alex dari Rusia. Halo, Alex. Halo, Obed. Oke, okay, gimana hari ini? Baik-baik saja semuanya? Iya. Yeah. Uh, so, everything Cukup is baik. good. So, pekerjaan lancar. Do you know lancar? Lancar is like smooth. So, everything yeah, goes well, like, smoothly. When some people say, when I just send them, couple of sentences in Bahasa this oh Bahasa Indonesia cukup lancar like oh uh, yes yes <laughs> lancar yes lancar is like yeah like fluent or like uh, no, no pauses so like lancar okay so runs. yeah lancar and not, not yeah not so bad so everything goes well yeah there like, were minor issues but nothing serious Oke, okay. hari ini kita melanjutkan, you know, melanjutkan, continue, melanjutkan, continue. Melanjutkan. Yes, melanjutkan uh, satu pelajaran lagi di bab 5. Do you understand? Continue one, one more lesson in chapter 5. Pelajaran lesson. Oke, okay, baik, uh, kita mulai. Let's start with this uh, audio file. So you are going to listen. Okay. So yeah. hopefully this is not too fast. Okay, let's start. Simakan 5.1 Berkunjung ke rumah orang tua Santi Hari ini saya berkunjung ke rumah orang tua Santi di Bandung. Rumahnya berkamar tidur tiga, beruang tamu satu, beruang keluarga dan ruang makan satu, berdapur satu, berkamar mandi dua, dan bergarasi satu. Rumahnya bersih dan cantik. Di rumah orang tua Santi, tidak ada banyak barang Mereka baru membeli rumah itu Mereka baru tinggal selama satu minggu Besok saya dan keluarga Santi akan berbelanja barang-barang untuk di rumah Kami akan membeli televisi, mesin cuci, penyejuk udara, lemari es, kompor, dan tempat tidur Nanti kami juga akan membeli lemari pakaian, lemari buku, sofa, kursi dan meja makan, dan lampu. Yeah, it's pretty slow, but it's it's quite long. But you know, no, I, I mean, I can even if even if it was faster, I, I would be able to recognize the words, but. I can distinguish the words, but I don't know most of them. So, oh, okay. <laughs> it does, even if you slow it down like three times, it would it wouldn't make it easier to understand. Anyway. Oh, okay. So okay, let's see then. I think um yeah. Somebody went to Santi's house. Yes. And he, he described some. Yes, correct uh, actually. In, So now I am uh, putting the PDF file. Can you see the file? Mm -hmm. Okay, and then I will put. Saya the... bisa melihat. Saya yes, kamu bisa melihat ya. And saya taruh. Do you know taruh? I put. Letakkan saya taruh the script of the audio file uh, in the chat box. So. Okay, let me find how to send it. Yes. Chat box. Okay. Uh, can you see it? Mm -hmm. This is the script.
Okay. Yeah, I can see. So let's start from the title. Berkunjung ke rumah orang tua Santi. Difficult? Any difficult word? Uh, visiting house of Santi's parents. Yes. Uh, ke, you know the the preposition ke is Go to. to. to yes. Going to. Like... Yes. Yes. Going to or visiting. Uh, berkunjung more to visit, right? Uh, going is like a general go, pergi. This is like visit. Berkunjung. Berkunjung is like uh, uh, go to a specific place and then like stay there for a while. Usually berkunjung is to your friend's house. So we use this word berkunjung, not just go. Berkunjung. So mengunjungi, berkunjung, it's like Okay. Yeah. And then the first paragraph. What do you think? Oh, I can understand. Uh, and per ber berkamar. Yes. Yeah, so the root word Tera... is kamar like... is room. So berkamar is uh, the prefix ber is to give the meaning of uh, having. So. Her house has uh, three bedrooms. Berkamar tidur. Kamar tidur is bedroom, right? So mm-hmm. berkamar tidur has bedrooms, and then the number of the bedroom is there. So three bedrooms. Beruang. Okay, this is kind of interesting. So be careful with the beruang. So beruang has three meanings. So beruang is bear, beruang, animal. Okay, and then uh, ber uang. This is uh, has money. And then ber uang. So this is ber supposed to be like this, but the way we pronounce it is the same. Do you see it? So beruang is so uh, depending on the context, so you know which meaning. That we are talking about, so we are we are obviously talking about rooms in uh, in the house. So beruang has room. Okay, so yeah. and uh, tamu is the name of the room. Yes, ruang. So you have to see the ruang. So ruang, uh, it can be kamar or ruang. So kamar tidur, bedroom. Ruang tamu is the ruang tamu is the guest room. The guest tamu is guest. Okay, and yeah, then makan ruang is like dining room. Yes, ruang makan dining room. Ruang keluarga is the living room. And then berdapur. So it has what is dapur? So ruang ruang dapur, but you can say dapur. Maybe bathroom. Or... Uh, bathroom that one. Kamar mandi. Mandi is uh, taking a bath. Mandi. So kamar mandi is bathroom. Dapur is kitchen. Dapur. So one kitchen and then two bathroom, two, two bathrooms, and then a garage. One garage. Bergarasi satu. Okay. So those those numbers are the number of the rooms. Okay. So ruang yeah. tamu, guest room, ruang keluarga, living room, ruang makan, dining room, dapur, kitchen, kamar mandi, bathrooms. So this is these are the vocabularies of uh, rooms in the house. Rumahnya bersih dan cantik. What do you think? Like clean and light. Uh, clean and what? Light. Light, right? Chan- cantik is beautiful actually. So yeah, it's like look look nice, properly nice and neat and beautiful. Okay, di rumah orang tua Santi tidak ada banyak barang. What's that? Banyak i what, what is banyak? I don't know. Banyak many. Banyak many. Sedikit, uh, little or few, sedikit. So, 
do you know do you speak bahasa Indonesia sedikit just uh, a, a little so sedikit can be uh, like uh, little or few I I remember barang makanan bar ba, ah, barang makanan mm-hmm. from uh, another text uh yeah barang is like uh barang like uh, things goods things items barang so there are not many things in their house yes do you know why the next sentence uh tells why mereka just moved there yeah? Yeah, just bought it just bought it yes baru membeli rumah itu that's why no not so many items or goods one week there. yes this one week so okay what is tinggal is stay right so they they stayed there mm-hmm. for only one week so nah, last paragraph what do you think Berbelan- oh, berbelanja berbelanja is uh, what is it belanja so berbelanja Maybe like clean or something like uh, berbelanja barang-barang what do you think so no idea berbelanja is to to shop so membeli is shopping. yeah membeli me, membeli is to buy berbelanja is specific on the shopping activity so berbelanja barang-barang because there are not many things in the house at the moment so tomorrow they are going to shop some items some goods untuk di rumah for for the house right or to be placed in the inside the house untuk di rumah so kami akan membeli uh, televisi you know right so this is uh, televisi mesin cuci what do you think so these are the items like the uh, what is it the appliance is it like you know the yeah not nothing mesin the mesin right so mesin mesin cuci is washing machine yes washing machine penyejuk udara udara is the air so air penyejuk, conditioner yes air conditioner so but this one literally literal meaning is penyejuk like cooler cooler so but i think this is aircon air, air, air conditioner so penyejuk udara lemari es what do you think s is ice So lemari is actually cup like cupboard. So we call it like cupboard of ice. <laughs> That's for refri- ah, ref- refrigerator, right? So lemari as kind of funny like cupboard of ice. That is the refrigerator and then kompor. Kompor is the the what is it? To to cook. This is the stove. Not mm-hmm. the stove. Uh, oven. Uh, no, oven is like to. Wait. Yeah, oven is like the microwave, right? Uh, to bake, mm-hmm. yes. But this is like you know, like using the commonly used is using the the gas, yeah, gas stove. But yeah, stove, right? Yeah. But nowadays maybe people start, yeah, like uh, using the electricity one. But still commonly used using the gas mm-hmm. stove and then tempat tidur. What is it? Like bed. Yes. Place to sleeping sleep. Sleeping place. So, yes, yeah, sleeping place. Bed. Okay. Nanti, you know nanti, right? Later. Later. Mm-hmm. Yes. Kami juga akan membeli lemari pakaian. So this is. We also will buy. Lemari the same cupboard, but cupboard of so like this is cupboard of ice refrigerator, but this is cupboard of pakaian. What is it? Pakaian, clothes. And then lemari buku. Book. Book. Yes, cupboard Case. of cupboard for yes books or bookcase or yeah. And then sofa the same sofa. Kursi dan meja makan. So kursi. The chairs and tables for, for eating. 
Yes, so for the dining room, right? So one set of the dining yeah. table and the lamp. Dish. Yes, and lamp. lamp. Yes, lampu. Yeah, so lampu is quite easy. So we just put the letter. So basically, we are we are learning about the. So because this is uh, who is this? Sarah, right? Sarah is visiting Santi's place. And then, yeah, we are talking about the the room inside the house. So focusing on the room inside the house, and then the items inside the house. That's it. Okay. So what yeah. do you think? Do you think you can get all of the vocabularies, or you need more time to repeat and get? I all can the... recognize, but I I don't think I can. Yeah, and I don't. Uh, do we have the picture? Let Let's check. You, you You can open the. You can still see the chat box, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. So only only the. Oh, we have the picture actually. So this is more like the what is it the the diagram of the house? Maybe so. Scheme. What is it? Plan. Yes, plan. This is not yeah plan, but Scheme. This, this, Scheme. Is not, this is not our plan. This is already uh, uh, already exists, right? So three three bedrooms you can see here. Kamar tidur. The K is for kamar. So three bedrooms. This one kamar tidur satu dua tiga and then what else? A uh, two two ba- uh, two bathrooms and then one living room, one guest room, one kitchen and then garage. Where is the garage? Maybe oh, underneath. Oh. Underneath. Oh, in Indonesia we we don't usually have basement, so no. Uh, that's not like our culture to have basement. <laughs> Only carport, right? So maybe this is not the perfect, the perfect like the carport only like this on like garage supposed to be like a room, right? Mm-hmm. So like the right. car going to inside the room, but this is only carport, like only put the car there. Yeah, so that's it. So this is the like the layout of the house, and then this this is the item. Uh, sofa. Kursi, tempat tidur, lamp, lampu. Oh, we, we don't have this one. This is like fan, right? What do you think, fan? Fan is kipas angin. Do we have it here? Kipas angin. Yeah, so... Yeah, obviously kipas angin is a lot cheaper than the aircon in terms of the electricity consumption. But it's way less effective yeah, in terms uh, of producing. Yes, yes, wool. yes. Yes, and then yeah, that's about it. I think so. Some of the items here is is not in the in the uh, audio files. So yeah, what that's... do you think? So A, what is A? What do you think is A? Is that like a just the when for, for the I clothes? Think... The cupboard for the clothes is it? This is not. You the... can be cupboard for anything, uh... but cupboard for clothes is called like a wardrobe. Oh yes, wardrobe. Yes, I think this is wardrobe, right? And then the television. What is it? C? C is like the table for dining. Okay. Yeah. So how how do you call fan? Kipas. Fan, kipas, kipas angin. Ah, kipas angin. Angin is uh what is it? Angin is like air. Uh, air is uh like flowing flowing air. That is angin. You you can feel it right if like the 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 wind blows the wind wind yeah. so wind yeah. Sejuk, yeah today. Sejuk is cool. Segar, segar. Yes, yeah, segar is yeah like fresh fresh and cool so. Yeah, you you can get that sensation right. 
fresh and cool, sejuk dan segar. Oke. Okay. Hmm, yeah, I think these are the vocabulary. So hopefully you can. Oh, we have this one over here. This is meja rias. Meja rias. Do you know meja rias? Is a table. Uh, L, yeah. Table for uh, rias. Rias is like makeup. So makeup, makeup table, right? So you have the mirror, and then you have the table to put all the. Yeah, it's, this is for the. The woman, the wife, use this, use this one. And then what else? Kasur. Where is kasur? Do you know kasur? Kasur is actually the the spring bed, but kasur is like the old, the old, like the mattress. But you know. Uh, We use this specific uh, material, so spring. But you, we, we use spring, right? Spring like the spring. But for the kasur, it's like our na- natural natural material. So ka- kasur. Uh, let's see. No, no. This is like yeah, kasur. So like traditional traditional uh, mattress for sleeping. Kasur. Kompor, right. is stove. Yeah, that's about it. Okay, so there you go. So last week you learned about uh, animals. Do you still remember tapir? Yeah, you know. <laughs> okay, so for this 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 one, you learn about the the rooms inside the house and then some items in uh, inside the the house. So, any questions? No, no. No, yeah, you just have to repeat, right? So that's that's the thing about vocabulary. So hopefully you can find the effective way to to memorize this. Uh, I'm not uh, sure. What is rak pirin? Rak yeah. rak is rak like self. Rak buku like book self, right? So rak piring, you know piring? Piring is plates, plates. So rak piring is like where you after you wash the dishes, you put uh, the plates. Yeah, you, like uh, you put, yeah. Pot so, bun guys, flower pot. What? Oh yes, yes. You know pot, right? Mm-hmm. Pot. Okay. Yes. Uh, I think that's also a uh, borrowed word. Pot. Of course. Yes. Anything else? Jemuran. Do you know jemuran? So this is jemur. And then the suffix an to make it a noun. Jemur is to. So this is like uh, the the old way of after you wash your clothes, you dry dry it up. Uh, outdoor. To, what do we call it? To put it under the sun, like outdoor. That's to to make it dry. To what do we call it in English? You know, right? Okay, maybe specific or just place it under the sun to dry, to dry <laughs> it naturally. <laughs> But like a long word to describe the activity. What what do we call it? Like you put the you so you kind of a place to put it. Maybe you have like to to clip it and then like that. Yeah. Anyway, so jemuran is the the noun. So all the clothes uh, that we put, we call it jemuran. Okay. Yeah. I think that's enough. If you do, you have any question? If you don't have any no, more no, question, no, no, we, that's fine. Yeah. Thank we you. can call it for today. Very yeah. So. See. Yeah. So that is all for this. Uh, actually, we still have one more reading, but. We will decide. So, are we going to skip this or no? So, you just you will need to tell me for this reading on the chapter five. If we skip this, yeah, we can just go on to the chapter. Oh, we can read it. Oh, okay. So we can use this for the next meeting. Mm-hmm. Okay. 
Yeah, so this is always the same thing, right? So uh, if you love reading, that will be very helpful. So uh, learning languages is about acquiring a lot and then, then yeah, listening and reading, listening and reading a lot. And then you can, yeah, that will form our yeah, vocabularies. Right, right. Okay. Terima kasih Alex sampai yeah, no. jumpa lagi di yeah, kelas berikutnya. Exactly. <laughs> Oke. Okay. Bye. Terima kasih banyak. Sama-sama.